Often when we're at work, we need to send larger files to people for them to review. And to do that, we need to use our Gmail, but Gmail has a 25 megabyte file size limit to what we're able to send. So when we have a really large file like that to send, it will actually send a link to our Google Drive rather than an attachment on the email itself. So let's demonstrate how to do that. I'm gonna go into our Gmail and compose a new email. And I'll go to my attachments and select a file that I know is going to be larger than 25 megabytes. And when I insert it, we'll have this um, message appear that our file is larger than 25 megabytes and that it will be sent as a Google link. And so that's what's happening right now. It's being transferred into a link rather than an attachment. So once that has finished uploading, we'll now have a link to our Google Drive in our email. Another way we can do this is right below where we have our send and our font sizes and that attachment like, like a little paper clip. We also have a Google Drive icon. If we click on that, we can insert our files using Drive and when we put in one that's really large like that, it will also just create a link. So I'm just gonna put in multiple files and you'll see how it will um, allow me to create a Drive link rather than putting in all those files individually. And we can see it actually gives me a message because we've selected more than 25 megabytes to attach, the selected attachments will be shared via a Drive link. So we have a couple of different ways that we can do that and share and send uh, large files to others.